everyone welcome back to my channel info science so today in this part let's discuss the phylum aselmintis so here the animals in this group these are known as the nematodes or roundworms they are triploblastic that means their body it develops from three germ layers that is the ectoderm mesoderm and endoderm they are bilateral symmetry so the body of the nematodes it can be cut into two equal halves in one plant they are pseudocoelomids that means the body cavity is known as the pseudocoelom and one of the important characteristic is that they have a complete elementary canal that means here in one end it is the mouth and the other end it is the anus so the body wall of the nematodes it is made up of three layers the outer layer is the cuticle so you could see here the picture which one is the cuticle then the second layer is known as the epidermis that is the multinucleated cell and the innermost layer it is muscular so the body wall of the nematodes it is made up of three layers and one of the important characteristics is that here the numbers of cells in every system is fixed that is the reproductive system or the excretory system here there the cells numbers is fixed next it possesses sexual dimorphism that means here the male and the female both are separate now let's discuss about the ascaris lumbricoid that means the male and female how it look like so here externally the male is smaller as compared to the female and they have a cylindrical body and the prostate and in case of the male is bent so you could see here in the picture how the prostate and it is bent and it has a common opening known as the cloaca so here in the male the digestive system and the reproductive system their opening is common and that is known as the cloaca but in case of the females the females are longer and have straight body and here the prostate and in case of the female is the anus and here the opening of the digestive system is anus and the reproductive system is the genital pore so externally in case of the male the digestive and the reproductive system they have a common opening known as the cloaca but in case of the female here the opening of the digestive system is the anus and the reproductive system is the genital pore now let us know about the both the male and female internally so here in the males they have a one set of reproductive system so that means they have a monarchic condition and in case of female they have a two sets of reproductive system so that means it is the didelphic condition so this ascaris lumbricoids their life cycle is completed in the humans now 
let's discuss about the classification of the phylum nematoda so the nematoda it is divided into two classes a fast meter and fast meter so in the class a fast meter the examples are griffella trichinella and in the class fast meter examples are ascaris eukarya and cytoma so these are the various examples of this classes